I'm going to show you how to import a model into Blender. Everything you'll need will be in the description, all the versions and links and etc. So there's two ways to import. Firstly, when you open up Blender, you want to press A and press Dell to delete everything in the scene. You're going to go to File, Import, and usually models use an FBX. Sometimes they're objects, but it depends. And this is without using uh, cats. Cats is the other option you can do so, uh, which is just import the model and you'll look for it. Um, an easy way to find a model if it's already in a package like this is uh, you'll click on the model, click on here, and it'll take you, you'll scroll up, and this is where it is. So you want to click on it, right click, show and explore, and then up here in a blank spot, when this highlights, press Control C. And you can either go through cats and paste it up here and press enter and it'll take you there. Or you can go to file, import, FBX, same thing, press it and import. Some models, depending on where you get them, can be imported incorrectly. So sometimes you may have to switch between the two. So I'm going to very quickly how to fix your display port as well. So I like to come up here and press the second circle. Click on the drop down. Change this to whatever one you want and then drag world opacity here. To fix purple textures, you're going to click on the material or uh, the, of the, the mesh. You're going to click on the material and you're going to get a base color. Click there. Click image texture. Click this little file icon, and the same way we paste it up here, you're going to paste it again. <clears throat> and if you need to go back out, you can press this to go back. Um, and you're going to find where it is. So for me, I believe it is in here. Nope, not there. It is in here. And usually it'll be in textures, skin tone, <clears throat> etc. And then now you have your texture back. If you have hair that requires a specific texture and it involves transparency, you're going to do the exact same thing. Um, this one doesn't have transparency, but that's fine. We're going to change this to opaque first. And then if it does use transparency, change it to alpha hashed. Up in the shading tab, you want to scroll out and click a random spot. And sometimes it'll come with an alpha already. <clears throat> oh, you can use that or you can delete it. And drag the textures alpha into the alpha. And then this will be transparent. And you're going to do that for everything else. And that is how you import model into Blender.